Hi, this is Michael David Lane, and today I want to answer the question, what is the diaphragm? In these early videos, I want to spend some time talking about breathing and the diaphragm. So I just want to take a step back and review what exactly the diaphragm is. When we talk about the diaphragm, we're specifically referring to the thoracic diaphragm, which is an involuntary muscle and the primary muscle of respiration, which is breathing. The word diaphragm means partition, so it separates two spaces. The thoracic diaphragm is a thin sheet of muscle that separates the thoracic cavity from the abdominal cavity. The thoracic cavity is the chest, the thorax, and that contains the lungs and the heart. And the abdominal cavity contains what we normally refer to as the guts, the viscera. And that's your stomach, intestines, liver, kidneys, etc. The diaphragm contracts when I inhale, and it releases as I exhale. And that's how the diaphragm contracts to help fill the lungs, pull air back in after I exhale. The diaphragm, in a completely released, lengthened state, creates a dome shape. And then the muscle contracts and shortens into a flat pancake shape. And that's how the muscle helps to pull air into the lungs. Since the diaphragm is the primary muscle of respiration, and singing is exhaling, it's very important for singers because if it releases too quickly, it's not going to keep air flowing through my larynx long enough for me to sing a full phrase and make decisions about my performance and my song. So it's key to singing, and that's why you should know what the diaphragm is.